that her? I'm so confused. Alright, so in season seven, our casting department was contacted by a guy named Dylan, who had fallen hard for a model named Savinia after meeting her on Facebook five years earlier. It turned out that Savinia had also reached out to our casting department six months earlier. She didn't tell him and he didn't tell her and they didn't realize that they'd both tried to get in touch with Catfish to meet on the show. So obviously we took the case. And the deeper we dug, the more convinced we became that Savinia was hiding something major. Let's go back to her Facebook page. Let's see if she's interacting with people and find someone that seems like they know her and send some messages. So the first person we, we reached out to is this girl, Colleen, because she had said, are you okay? You should come over soon. That sort of, that seemed like someone she might know yeah. in person. And she called us. Okay. So All this right. is where it's, things start to get a little bit less clear. Okay. We asked her if they're still in touch. She's like, yeah, we still talk. And I said, well, has he ever talked about or mentioned a guy named Dylan? And she's like, no, I don't think so. But I think her sister Riley has mentioned somebody named Dylan. And then she said, Riley's older. Wow. She's like older. 23, 24. But right, why would she start talking to a 14 year old when she herself was 18? 18. I'm confused, I'm thoroughly confused. It could mean nothing, it could, who knows, right? So the next thing we did was, so we went to Riley's page. Here's what's crazy. Savina's number is listed as Riley's number on Facebook. Now, you've talked to her on this number and thought it was Savina. It's weird that the phone number comes back to Riley's page and not Savina's page. Yeah. Maybe you've been talking to Riley this whole time. Sometimes Max and I really felt like big brothers to, to people on the show, and in this case, for sure, we really didn't want to see him get his heart broken. Seem a little antsy. On the inside, it's wrecking havoc. I've always had this like envision you see all in all, when all these people meet online for the first time and they're real and they run up and hug each other and they're super excited. I've always had that envisioned in my head and then now like learning all this, it's just, I don't know, it's kind of breaking it down. What's so bad that she's kept from me for the past five years and she can't tell me? At the meetup, something happened that none of us could have ever predicted. Is that her? I'm so confused. That's Savina. Wow. Hi. There's like nothing in there right now. <laughs> so what's the, what's the big secret? Uh, uh, the, the big secret is that like, you know, I posted a lot of photos of me looking really like good, like photoshopped. And I like, I'm not like that. As you can see, I don't look like that. Shut up, you're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I was just really scared to meet you because I'm a giant and I just, <laughs> and I'm sorry for laughing, I'm just really nervous. <laughs> oh. So the whole big secret is that like you might look different in the pictures? I'm really self-conscious. A lot of my photos are super Photoshop. I feel like I was catfishing him. My boobs are Photoshop, my butt's Photoshop, my face looks flawless. I don't look human, I look like a supermodel and I'm not. I'm really lanky and dorky and awkward and I just didn't want him to see that side of me, so. I kind of think we've hit the point though in, in social media culture where, where we kind of just expect that those photos that you're gonna look a little yeah. different in and your life don't anyway. Look that no. Different. If I saw you, I would recognize you. Okay. When I emailed you guys, I was only 17. It was really a cry for help. 
I wanted to meet him and I didn't know how to do about it. So you're 18 now. Yes. And everything that Dylan knows about you is exactly that, true. Yes. Why does your sister's Facebook page have your phone number on it? Because a year ago, I changed, like, I needed a new phone because my phone, like, crapped the bed on me. And I just took her phone, and we just never really realized that it was still on her Facebook until, like, now-ish. So. And she never spoke to Dylan? No. So it's I been don't... you the whole time. Yes. Your profile. Yes, it's me. And your feelings for Dylan are... Extremely strong. I'm trying to really put myself out here and like be upfront with you guys. The only person that yeah. it matters that you're upfront with is Dylan. Do you have any questions? Yeah. I don't know what to say. Well, hey, I'm <laughs> overjoyed. Yeah, I, this, this very rarely happens for us. And that hug, oh, that like, I think I remember they were like trembling. They were so excited. And then we followed up with them, you know, a few weeks later and they were together. Oh! What's up? What's oh up? my God. Wait a second. Where are you? We're in Virginia. Virginia? You already went yeah. down there? Yeah. yeah. This is amazing. <laughs> we gotta get a whole update here. So what are you? Boyfriend or girlfriend? Yeah. Yes! Yeah, we got one. <laughs> I am so hopeful that they are still together. Very excited to find out. Haven't talked to them in a while, so let's find out. Yo! Going, dude. Let's catch up because I'm very curious, obviously, and I think everybody wants to know what the deal with you and Savinia? Uh, not together anymore. Come on! Wait, so how long did you and Savinia go out? <laughs> it's a lot different in person, and there's a lot of personality traits and stuff that, like, you don't really pick up until you're in person. And wait, so you like, guys, wait, but you guys live together? For, for, yeah, for, for a while. And then how did it, so how did it end? What, was it a bad breakup? No, it was, uh, it was mutual. Wow, so after seven years, things really just, like, kind of, dissolved and went away that just like that you don't talk to her anymore no nope. crazy all right man well thanks for the update glad glad you're doing well good to see you it's good to see you man and uh yeah good luck with everything all right thank you have a good one man later dylan if you want more catfish content click here now and don't forget to subscribe